All right, is that thing a meteorite? That's what one New Jersey family wants to know after it crashed into their home last night. Yeah, that's right. Now scientists and meteorite enthusiasts are eager to get a glimpse of space history. Jim Vassell has more from Hopewell Township. Yeah, it sounds kind of crazy to think that you can own a piece of space or hold a piece of space. Call it the Mercer County Meteorite, a suspected space rock that crashed through the roof of this home in Hopewell Township is sending space enthusiasts into orbit. Our Already. apartment is like a little museum. Our apartment's full of them, like literally all different types. Brett Cohen and Lisa D. Cristofaro aren't just into space rocks. It's their business. They're the owners of the Interstellar Collection LLC based outside of Philadelphia. They're the owners of many meteorites like this one. This is from Russia, 2013. Meanwhile, fellow enthusiast Andrew Krugel from Morris County owns about 30 meteorites himself and says there's special excitement about this particular space rock. It's called a hammer stone, so so it's something that's struck a man-made object and that multiplies the value several fold at least compared to just an ordinary meteorite that you found in the desert for instance. While they're here these enthusiasts are going to be searching the area for any fragments left behind and they say they wouldn't be surprised if over the next few days other enthusiasts start to pour in from all over the country. This is a pretty rare event to have a, a meteorite hit a man-made structure. And they're not the only ones enthused. And everyone in the department here is really excited too to even have the chance to get a glimpse of it. Dr. Shannon Graham is a geophysicist at the College of New Jersey. She says the plan is for the homeowners to bring in the meteorite for examination, giving the family an idea of what they can do with it next. We have a, a scanning electron microscope on campus that can help us analyze the chemical composition of, of the suspected meteorite, and that can help tell us, you know, basically what it is, what kind of meteorite it might be. For this rock to make it all the way from space to the Garden State, the odds are pretty out of this world. But the fact that it hit, you know, a populated area and people found it right away, like that's that's very, very rare uh, for like a once in a lifetime or generation kind of a event. In Hopewell Township, Jim Vassell, Pix11 News.